Can we skip to the good part? You've arrived at your destination. Let's go, sit, let's roll. Straighten it, straighten it, straighten it, straighten it. Straighten it. Straighten it. Straighten it. Hands down the best hotel we have ever stayed in and we've stayed at some nice hotels but this hotel takes the cake like not only the room but the amenities as well just keep watching the vlog to see the tea but this is amazing so come through this is the little dining area we've got the loft room which is like two floors basically so incredible so it actually comes with a dining room a kitchen it gives you a coffee machine and water and it gives you like plates and cups and everything like that an oven like what what is in here? I don't even know. Okay, cupboard space, storage. I think people actually live in this building. Like, people have money in this life, but one day we'll get there. <laughs> um, right, and then this is the living room. Guys, I'm literally manifesting this whole Dubai apartment. Like, this living room is so cute. For, like, it's so big as well for a hotel room. Amazing. And then we have this area. This is the fridge. Guys, I'm literally, as I'm recording this, I'm figuring things out myself. Oh, it's got a fridge um, for water and drinks and a freezer. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see that. That's amazing. And then we have a TV console area. This is like mirrored, so it's just so nice. Like, it makes it look even bigger than it is. So then we've got a huge TV, probably like, I'd say like at least 60 inch, 50 inch? Probably 50 inch. At least a cheeky 50 inch and it has like a welcome message, so cute. The staff as well here are 10 out of 10 chest kiss. It's got this massive painting over here, which I really like. It's really, really nice. And then we've got this gorgeous like chandelier. Like, what, what even? I just can't do it. Okay. okay, guys, let me take you to one of my favorite parts of this apartment, which is the balcony. Oh. Get into it. Are we seeing this? Like, so, okay, so we have this balcony area. Hopefully, you can hear me. This whole big balcony area to ourselves, which is so nice. It's got gorgeous light, it's really warm, and it's got views of the birds. Khalifa. Like, hello? Are you alright? The birds. It's right there. <laughs> like that's the birds, like that's the birds keeping like, over the head. So yeah, as you can see this hotel is just let me show you our room as well, which is actually upstairs. Yeah, we're gonna upstairs. Okay. We don't play. Don't play. So take this lovely stair. I feel like I'm on like those property shows. If you want to take the lovely stairs up to the mezzanine, is that a thing? Mezzanine. <laughs> mezzanine is a thing. No, right? you're right, you're right. <laughs> I should, I, I'll be a real estate agent in another life. But, literally, we're, we're still going and it's still the same room. Like, it's crazy. Okay, so this is the bedroom area. Guys, like, are you kidding me? 
you actually see me? The bed, this is like a king, right? It's giving me a king size. Yeah, I'll say king size. King size bed, gorgeous headboard, another TV, just in case the downstairs one wasn't enough for you. We have another TV up here. It's got a little getting ready area for the gorgeous girlies. It's got a telephone here. And then come and see this. Come and see this. Come and see this. Yeah. Check this out. Check this out. How stunning is that? And then the, and then with the chandelier like cascading down. So beautiful. Absolutely stunning. It also has a little um I guess chill spot where you can just read, I guess. If you don't want to sit on your bed, you can sit on the chair. So yeah, that is our room. Absolutely obsessed with it. So gorgeous. And yeah, we're just gonna like unpack. Oh, I forgot the bathroom. Am I all right? I'm not, I'm not a very good real estate agent right now. <laughs> the um, linen is etched with the hotel name. Like, what? I want this in my house. I want my name on the linen in my house. Just saying, husband, <laughs> make that happen. Um, then we have our cute bathroom. It's pretty spacious. There's actually a downstairs bathroom as well. But this is our upstairs bathroom. Would you call I guess it's an ensuite, yeah. This is the ensuite bathroom. It's got like really nice black tile. Like waterfall, rainfall, waterfall shower. And then it's also got the other just like handheld shower. So pretty, so cute. And then it's got this really nice lighting as well for when you're getting ready. So nice, so, so nice. And then we also have the storage here, which is where we have our suitcase. And then we have some robes as well and some slippers. So, oh, I love that there's like mm, ambient lighting in the um, storage, love that. Oh, and then it has a mirror here. Cheeky little mirror for your cheeky mirror selfies. Or just like to check your outfit. So cute. And then this is where the safe is, hair dryer, etc. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So that is our room. I can't even cope. Like when we came, because we saw loads of pictures and like TikToks on it, but like it blew our minds. I feel like it doesn't even do it just, I feel like even this camera won't do it justice. It's so amazing. But yeah. We're just gonna unpack now and we're gonna grab some lunch and then I think today's gonna be like a bit more of a chill day because it was like kind of traveling. We arrived, we landed at 6 a.m. So yeah, we're gonna head up to the pool. Watch, guys, when I show you the pool upstairs, the views, anyway, keep watching the vlog. But yeah, let's unpack. So we've just checked in, settled in, and now we are off to get some brunch. It's midday now. We arrived here around 10 o'clock. So we're gonna head to breakfast. It's on the 70th floor. Not breakfast, we're gonna have, we're gonna have brunch. It's on the 70th floor, 70th floor. Our room is on the 50th floor. This place, honestly, is insane. This is definitely the best hotel I have ever stayed in. And it's gonna be hard to top, but let's see what the food is given. <laughs> Literally. Look at the lifts. Like, and there's so many different lifts as well. It's like, I'm literally getting lost, but what would you rate it so far out of 10? This is off the scales. I can't even, 10 isn't even gonna do it justice. This is too good. Best hotel I have ever heard. This is how we start in 2023. We'd love to see it. But let's actually press the lift. <laughs> So guys, <laughs> my my parents actually we took like a three hour nap because the sleep that we didn't sleep on the flight caught up with us. Yeah, so we literally took a nap and I feel alive again. I was so tired after we went to the room and now we're just gonna go get some snacks, bits and bobs, drinks and stuff like that for the next few days. And the store is like one minute away. So I'm just gonna walk there. It's like a mild evening. It's a little bit like, I wouldn't say cold, but it's definitely mild in the night. So yes, this is the view at night, by the way. 
it's so beautiful. The badge is like lighting up and it's doing like a light show, which is so cool. I bought, I think it's like New Year's or something. It's so sick. And then this is our view, nighttime view. I just love this city so much. Wow, beautiful. I can't get over this badge, like how close it is to us as well. So guys, so a bit later on now, it's about 11 o'clock. I just ordered some room service and we got back from the shop like not too long ago. We got some African Fanta, they do African Fanta in Dubai. And we got some Mirinda, nachos, chocolate, snacks, all that kind of thing. And now I've ordered room service. I just got a zinger with some fries. And I love how they give you these little mini Tabascos and ketchup <laughs> and mayo. <laughs> Please relax. So now we're gonna watch a movie and yeah, we're gonna call it a night really. Just have a chilled one because tomorrow we've got a really busy day at a beach club. We're going to a beach club and then we're going clear kayaking tomorrow. Like I'm kind of shook, but I'm so excited. And then yeah, we'll see where that takes us. So tomorrow's gonna be really exciting. So I'll see you in the morning. Dubai. It is Sunday morning, our first full day, and the sun is out. It's warm. I'm so excited to be here. Today, like I said, we're going to San Beach Club. So I'm just gonna get ready quickly. I'm gonna get myself a coffee and then we're gonna head there at 11 30 because the last seating for the beach bit is 12 o'clock. So I need to get a move on and get ready. I think I'm gonna pack two outfits because I wanna get like two different pieces of content. Honestly, the dedication is real right now. But yeah, I'm gonna make a coffee and let's get ready and then I'll speak to you guys when we're on the way. everything amazing and our food has just arrived so it looks too good it's the 
too tasting for me. This is our drinks. We got this frozen raspberry fleshy. It looks so good. And watermelon as well. And this is our view. Look at the scenes. Oh, 10 out of 10. Enjoyment. Kayaking beach, it's called La Mer, and we're just waiting for the staff to come meet us. Waiting for some random guys, and it's gonna be sunset, so I think it's gonna be a really cute vibe. This is what the beach looks like, it's really quiet and peaceful here. So, yeah, so far I can't see any kayaks, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure we're close. And I think they said that we should wait here, so we'll update you when we're there. It's giving chocolate golden hour realness right now wow love so anyway we're waiting for the guy we finally met him and he's bringing the kayak oh i can see him i can see the kayaks guys it's not a scam you know them ones when you're just looking around it's like hmm okay so you know kayaks but he's bringing it i think there's like a storage unit around here but yay i am kind of nervous i'm not gonna lie but i'm excited i hope this water's not too deep because your girl can't swim i can swim but i can't swim swim you know what i mean like i can I can swim in a pool, not the ocean. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Okay. Uh, 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 At this point, I've given up, and my husband's just taken Absolutely over. <laughs> Absolutely. This is not. I thought it would be easier than this, and I thought it would be motorized. Sorry, but why is it so hard? Like, this is manual labor at this point. Okay, we need to turn, babe. Are, are you telling me what to do? <laughs> we need to go that way. Yeah, oh my so gosh, nice. this looks so crazy. Look, it looks like the world is moving. Can, do you know what I mean? <laughs> this is, is it, oh my gosh, and there's a fishing line right here. Hmm, what the heck is going on? Why are there so many fishing lines? <laughs> anyway, the sun is setting and it looks really beautiful. It's actually the only stunning. Thing I don't like is the fish on that. Yeah. Why, why am I going? Why am I about to put the fish on that? <laughs> <laughs> what if the fish comes, then what? Then I'm going to catch the fish. Ah, uh, hell to the now. So do you reckon that this is like for dinner? Yeah, probably they're catching fish for dinner. Because there's actually quite a lot of them Okay, let me do. Oh my gosh, there's a fish. I told you. Ah! I, look, I told you we'll catch it. Oh, hell <laughs> no. Uh oh. Wait, congrats. Let's. Yes. Do you remember that movie that we saw? What movie? Um, when they were stuck out at sea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trying to get from... What was it? What was it? Don't talk about a movie that people are stranded out at sea when we're no, in the sea. No, I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> this kind of reminds me that like, because these lot had to... like Fish. No, to survive. Like, fish, but remember that like, they had to like kayak through... Okay, let's not let's stop talking about it. Let's stop talking about it. Let's stop talking about it, okay? Thank you. <laughs> Why are you running? One thing about this place, when the sun sets, leg it home. Because well, it gets so cold it's like not, that. It's not that cold. I'm freezing. I'm sorry, it's not that cold. But I get cold very easy. You've got, you got to stay with me for better or for worse. Like right now it's cold. You know what I mean? Doesn't mean like you run away. Honey, when it's cold, I'm out. Wow. Sorry. Wow. I'll meet you on the other side though. So we are back from the beach club and the beach it was so much fun today we are going out now to eat we're going to asia asia it's actually only like 10 minutes away from our hotel if you watch my last dubai vlog you'll have seen oh excuse me i literally had a red bull because i'm kind of getting tired like the time difference is getting to me but 
Asia. Anyway, last time I came to Dubai, I went to Asia, Asia. It was in a different area though. And this one is closer to us. It's like 10 minutes away. So we're gonna try that out. I love Japanese food. If you watch my vlogs, you guys will know I'm a stan for a little bit of sushi, you know? So we're heading out now. I'm gonna show you our outfits. Oh, and then I think we're gonna go to One Oak afterwards. So we're supposed to meet up with our friend Kaj, but she bailed, she lives here. So she said she'll meet us later on in the week. But that's fine, we're still gonna go. We're still gonna have a good time. Um, babe, I'm gonna show our outfits quickly. So, I'm wearing this dress from Club L. It's got this like cute feather detail. I'm wearing it with this jackless black bag and some mini baby heels. And that's the look, what are you wearing? Just a two piece and some unexamined queens. It's just as simple for today. So simple, simple, eh? So yeah, all right, let's head out. First night in Dubai. Yesterday we spent the night inside because we're grandmas. But um, I think it was only right. We was actually so shattered. We were like, yeah, we're gonna go out to dinner. And then we had a nap. The nap ended up being three and a half hours. We woke up and it was like dark outside. We we're like, we ain't going nowhere. But the nap was much needed, so. Yeah, first night in Dubai. a good mood woke up and guess where we're going guys to the gym who is she this is heavily influenced by my husband because me as for me and my and my previous life i was gonna say me and my house but my story is changing okay my previous life i have i don't think i've ever been to the gym once on holiday but guess what 2023 I'm gonna do better so we're going to work out and the gym is so beautiful so that helps and then we book some massages afterwards that incentivized me for sure so I'm excited, I've got some water. Mr. Mans Morning. is ready. And let's head to the gym, I've got my AirPods. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do a 12, 3, 30. Just like an easy workout, nothing crazy. Last night was so fun though. We ended up at One Oak and it was actually such a good time. DJ One Take was playing and yeah it was just it was it was actually really lit so yeah so our first night was a success we had such a good time where did we go before that oh we went to asia asia in uh, what's it called business bay. in business bay we went to the asia asia before in marina, Dubai marina. in the marina but i reckon that one that one was a bit better i'm not gonna lie but it was still good but if you're gonna go to asia asia the, mar the marina one is chef's kiss We just came back from the gym it was really good they had like this kind of peloton style treadmill so the lady was like kind of speaking to you like pushing you so i intended to just walk but i actually ended up jogging so i'm feeling good feeling good feeling skinty no i'm joking um <laughs> imagine imagine if you could just lose weight from one workout god anyway it's coming it's coming so yeah we're heading to the massage now and i hope i nap like i hope it's that good I'm sure it's gonna be amazing. It was about 
100 pounds each 500 dirham and they also have like sauna and jacuzzi so that'll be fun yeah oh also uh, imagine we were working out and i could see the view of the burge like how would that not motivate you to work out? It was just stunning, that gym. Probably the best gym I've been to. Like, I could see the birds, I could see the skyline. Like, it was so nice. The weather's gorgeous. Like, yeah. Excited for an amazing day. Day two, let's go. Sign some consultation forms before we go in and then circle like your main concerns on your body, like it's your back, etc. And yeah, then we're gonna head in. Guys, look how aesthetically pleasing this part is. So, oh, lush. We have our come drinks. So cute. Some iced tea and some apricots and some warm towels. So after the massage, this is the facilities where you can just hang out, the pool, I mean, well, the jacuzzi, bridges, absolutely stunning, the tea, chill out, and this is the outdoor bit, absolutely stunning. This is what it looks like from the outside. sun is setting so it just looks so gorgeous this view I will never get over it guys this is the life I have it all to myself as well this is just chef's kiss just me and my thoughts <laughs> So, massages were stunning. I was literally this close to falling asleep because they were that good, but um, oh, they were so good. And then they, they even washed my feet. I was like, man, you don't have to do that. But yeah, they massaged our feet, washed our feet. It was just oh, princess treatment, period. But the only con is that the male and female facilities are separated because it's like a Muslim country, so like I guess the women wouldn't want men to see them exposed with like a bikini or swimsuit. And she's understandable, but it means that my man is not here. But um, yeah, just time to get some alone time, do you know what I mean? I'm gonna probably be here for like a couple minutes, not too long, because we need to get ready for dinner. We don't know where we're going yet as well, so we need to figure that out. But TikTok has been such a plug. We've been literally been figuring out plans as we go through TikTok, so. Been really good. Oh, it was such a nice relaxing day, especially because how crazy yesterday was and last night. So it's been really nice. And you can actually see the sunset from here, which is just oh, incredible. But yeah, let's get some bubbles in here. Let's get some bubbles. Bubble this please. Yep. three minutes that's all I could hack and when I came out again I was like oh that kind of felt good <laughs> it's like you know when it's like nice pain but I was like yeah I need to stop so I think I'm gonna go upstairs do my wash off do your makeup and get ready for dinner I, I might actually have to find out where to go because I have no idea but yeah there you go outfit for the second night this dress is from ASOS this bag is from Olivia Sales and my Ego Heels. Can you do your outfit quick? Come on, babe. It's every day. It is every day, babe. It's every day. It's every day, bro. Yeah, but I actually don't know where I got everything last time. I'm honest. You know, just doing all black. The night dogs. LV pouch. Simples. Simples. Let's go to dinner because we're late. <laughs> quick 10 minute beat. I just did concealer and bronzer and gloss, honestly. 18 minutes, guys. Whatever. You're a snake. 
Avocado looks like the avocado from my dreams. So creamy. I'm so excited to try it. Okay, taste test. They also have these plantain chips, which is just incredible. Mm. It's the best buck I've ever had in my life. No cap. Oh my god. We went to the rooftop as well after dinner because the food was so good and the sh like literally I think genuinely I'm not even exaggerating some of the best food I've actually ever had and I was literally blown away my taste buds were in space like it was so good oh my gosh so yeah um, and the chef was so lovely and then he recommended us to go to the roof afterwards so we went to the rooftop and just chilled for a little while there the dj was such a vibe it was like house music but it was like i could tolerate it like it was it was actually a vibe so yeah i came home now the freaking taxi driver tried to scam us he was literally like wasn't gonna let us out of the car <laughs> but um that was a little weird um but yeah so now we are home I'm gonna take makeup off go to sleep and then tomorrow we're actually switching hotels sadly i wish we just stayed here the whole time but we're gonna move to a different hotel and then we've got some activities planned we're going skiing yeah skiing in dubai like what the sea is actually just freaking crazy like whatever you want to do you can do in this in the city like dubai is like it's literally like a global village i guess it's like if you want to feel like you're in alaska or if you want to feel like you're in LA, you can all feel it in one C, which is crazy. But yeah, gonna go to bed. Probably um, watch an episode to make me fall asleep of Netflix. And I'll see you in the morning. Dubai so far, it just never disappoints. I didn't think that Dubai could get better, but every time I come, it just gets better and better and better. And it's only day two or day three, and like she hasn't had my life. We're like, we have to live here at some point. We have to, we just have to. It'll be rude not to. But yeah, good night. See you tomorrow. Girlies. It's day four in Dubai and we've actually switched hotels. Um, if you watched my previous part two of the Dubai vlog last year, we stayed at the five JVC and we've moved here now. Um, so we are staying here for the next few nights and let me show you around the room. This is the room. It's really cute. It's got this nice view and a balcony as well. TV, TV, water station, and some drinks as well. Well, and a mini bar as well. And this is the bathroom as well. This is the moment. This bathtub is so nice. Imagine just having a bubble bath with this view, especially at night. I just feel like, wow, 
stunning. The lighting is so nice in here as well. Also, if you come to Dubai and are looking for a little bit more of an affordable but still luxurious hotel, this is really, really nice. I would recommend. I've stayed here before and it's really nice. They've got really nice restaurants as well and you have access to Five Palm Beach and the Beach Club, which is really popular. Like A lot of people go there when they come to Dubai. So that is also a bonus. I think you get a shuttle there as well from the hotel, which is cool. But yeah, so we've just got our bags in the room and we're just gonna head to the mall because we wanna go skiing today. I don't know, ooh, I think I am. But I've just been really adventurous recently. I'm like, oh yeah, let's do skiing. I've been skiing before in Chamonix near Mont Blanc. So that was actually really fun. And I've always said I would wanna do a ski holiday again. So why not do it? It's a bad since we can, why not? So yeah, we're gonna do that and then we're gonna go to this really cute spot later on to have like early dinner. And then we just need to figure out a restaurant tonight as well because that's the story of our lives. Like we literally have barely booked any dinner spots. <laughs> but so far so good. This is just so gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Wow. Good morning. Today is desert day and we are literally heading out to breakfast right now and then we have a pickup at two o'clock for the desert. We booked a private car and we're gonna have like a little desert safari and then we're gonna ride some atvs so should be really fun i'm excited i've got my desert vibe hat on right now to block the shade and i'm wearing the same outfit as the other day because who gonna who gonna beat me who gonna beat my ass who <laughs> nobody can say that but yes yeah, so heading out let's go it's a beautiful day Guys, we have ordered. I'm so freaking excited. We've ordered some pancakes. We've ordered some chicken waffles. We've ordered some fries. Waffle and sandwich. Chicken waffle sandwich. And what's the smoothie? Oh, guys, strawberry and oh, mango. Strawberry and coconut smoothie. Sounds so good. Sounds fresh. This is exactly what I need. Our driver has said he's going to pick us up at 2.30. So we have about an hour to eat. And then... We're gonna head to the mall afterwards. I just love how easy this trip has been. It's just been breezy, like chilling, enjoying eating. That's literally what we've been doing, and oh, loving every second of it. Uh, yeah, so let's see when the food gets here. We've come here before and we know the food slaps, so it's called Sarah Beth's. When you come to Dubai, definitely visit. I'll show you when the food comes, you're gonna, you're gonna understand what I mean. Okay, guys, the smoothie is here. How cute does it look? It looks so delicious, and I think it's all made of fresh fruit so let's do a little taste test oh, wait. Wait to try this. oh it's so good Refreshing, right because i had it um what is your mommy of? i had it at mm. what was the other place that it's we so were fresh it's so fresh oh food is here so these are the pancakes it looks so fluffy and it's got some strawberry sauce we got some chicken waffles and fries. We got some mushrooms. Ew, scary. And then we have strawberry smoothie. Yum. Let's get it. 
guys went came to the shop and they kitted us out. Um, what would you call that? Um, Catching, kind of. No, just held it. Yeah, we we just held the falcon. We just we just held the falcon, and it was so scary. But <laughs> literally, I have a scratch. But it's worth it because that was actually a great experience. And um, yeah, we're just gonna head back. Um, onto the safari, the desert safari tour now. Yeah. So far, so good. But the thing is, guys, make sure you wear glasses and a mask because the way that we've been eating yeah. sand, Ooh. it's not a joke. So put on our masks, and it's actually really hot. Gets me right. It's like somehow the sand gets through my glasses. Yeah, because your glasses are small. Yeah. I mean, I bought these big boys. Because I, I was like, I, hey I or the, now. I thought this sand was still getting into your eyes. Just a little bit, but okay. not as much as you. Yeah. But yeah. I'm <laughs> breakfast it's about 10 o'clock we are low-key worried that breakfast is over i'm just i'm so concerned and confused why breakfast at hotels on holiday finish at 10 o'clock like i know some people get up really early and like go about their day but some of us we like a lion here and there we're literally on holiday so why is the breakfast finished at 10 but hopefully it's 11 so we're gonna go down and check that out right now yesterday at the desert was so much fun we literally knocked out when we got back we were so tired it really takes out of you being in the sun all day but it was so 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 fun and yeah today we're off to abu dhabi so let's get on I never breakfast and we are on a road trip to Abu Dhabi I just woke up from my nap because if you can hear my voice I've got like a bit of a cold I think it's from sleeping with the AC on so rookie mistake but it's all good we're on the way we're actually about 10 minutes away now we're going to Ferrari world which is basically like a big theme park and it's got the fastest roller coaster in the world so I don't know why I got myself into this I hope you glued your wig down Oh, baby, <laughs> this is glue to the gods. This is not going anywhere. So, yeah, on the way. You've noticed we've got a little, a new little baby for the day. We booked a Bentley for the road trip because my man does not know how to do small things. I said, oh, should we just get a car for, I mean, Abu Dhabi? He was like, yeah, should we get a Bentley? So, <laughs> but it's actually so beautiful. And he's very happy. Look, he's not stopped smiling uh, this whole smiling time. Like this, the whole journey, the whole hour. The whole whilst hour you, of you the drive. Anyway. I've been napping. You always, you always I woke leave, up. You always leave. Me it's alone. my cold. I've got no. a cold. Like, guys, she always does this, right? When we go on a long journey, she always like leaves me. I've like, actually not done that in so long. No, I have you not. Always do that. I actually tried to stay up these days, deep here. I'll be quiet. Manchester. I'll be quiet. I've not slept. You know, maybe next Thank time you. I'll sleep with you. Okay. Yeah, we'll both sleep on the road. Yeah. Girl. Okay, look at the scenes. This is the motorway. The motorway has palm trees. <laughs> wow. So, yeah, this is Abu Dhabi. It's my first time in Abu Dhabi and it's so, 
so far so beautiful like wow we'll have to come here for the formula one next next time because this looks like a whole mood we just walked, we drove past the university why does it look like the taj mahal like wow so yeah back to pull up to ferrari world and then we have dinner later on so hopefully i'll have a red bull because i'm a little bit a little bit tired but I, i'm blaming on the cold but yeah it's a beautiful day wow look at this guys oh can you see that like you just don't get that in england i'm sorry look at this so stunning also um can i just mention this car has massaging seats so when we're on the way i put the, um, the massage button on and it was massaging me on the motorway so how can i not fall asleep like are you kidding and it's actually really good pressure like it was actually massaging me and i was like wow this is the life passenger princess vibes like can't ask for anymore do you know what i mean and the ac is so good as well it's like it feels like you're in a different climate now so yeah i love it can you get this car for me for my 30th birthday i'll get it for me <laughs> that's not what i wanted to hear but uh okay oh they have a water world as well oh guys look how nice oh the camera doesn't even do it justice but oh so nice so this is abu dhabi yas mall look how freaking gorgeous There's a fountain in the mall. So we're just walking, trying to find Ferrari World. It's through the mall, so we're just blown away. We just went on the fastest roller coaster in the world and it was torture. <laughs> But it was so fun. Would you go oh. on it again? You know, I'd actually think twice. It goes apparently what 150 miles an hour. Oh my gosh! And then it just shoots you straight up. Yes. I wasn't expecting that. I don't think I've screamed like that in my life. <clears throat> my voice feels like it's going. It was so good though. It was so much fun. We're gonna get some food now because we deserve it. We earned it. At one point I was like, can we do this? But we did it, Joe. So yeah, we're gonna get some food now. So we finished up at our Ferrari World now and we're on our way to Hakkasan. We're running a little bit behind because there's a lot of traffic. It's actually further than we thought it was. Oh, there's actually a lot of traffic, but we've just pulled into the Abu Dhabi skyline. It's so beautiful. It was about 30 minute drive from Ferrari. What is that? Why is that leaking water? What the heck? Is that normal? This truck is literally like, I don't know if you can see. Does he know that that's happening? It's literally leaking. I don't understand. That looks quite scary. Come rewind. Girl, I get the money with you, make your mind up. If you love Guys, look at this. Oh my gosh. Give me love and make me nice, so nice, so nice, so I feel make your mind up. Girl, I love you, plus I never make your mind up. If I let you smoke, it's you gonna lose my light. If you paranoid, then I'm gonna spend the night. You're gonna look at that loving every day. Time I'm gonna ask you with my money, I go pay. For your love, I go pay, uh. It ain't making my day chase, uh. No, I feel no day for you every day. When you call, run it back on replay. For your love, I go pay, uh. For your love, I go play, uh. Stop. Make a psycho, make a traffic psycho. Baby, if you nice, you go drop me psycho. If you have it, it don't make me mad, uh. Make it make you sing, sing to the mic in my room Girl, you are that looking in your eyes, oh Show you many things you can utilize, oh If I say I love you, then I tell you like, so Show you everything that I get to nice, oh True that, make it utilize, oh Girl, when we talk, the way go revive, oh Give you many things, we put them, make you dance, oh Girl, make you back up to the stand the mic If it's morning and he never call you back, you should leave him Let me put some money in your bag Today we at the mall. Hey friends. Yes, sir. Hey guys. We just got here. We're nice and covered up because you know how in the mall you're not allowed to, you know, dress crazy. So yeah, we're gonna do some shopping, we're gonna do some eating and yeah. What are you buying? I'm buying you it's like a birthday suit. Um I've actually already got you a present. So. Really? Me? I'm this the present. My presence is the present. Bye guys. <laughs> 
so yeah this mall is humongous so we're not trying to waste too much energy because later on we're going skiing in the mall it is in the mall we need to double check that actually so yeah we're gonna go to cheesecake factory just have some nice easy food and then we're gonna fuel up and then go to skiing which i'm kind of nervous but yeah let's go to cheesecake factory because i'm starving I haven't eaten all day and it's about two o'clock okay this girl needs some food new it's so convenient it's like a help point and you can search where you want to go and then it shows you the directions 81 meters okay that's quite close hey all right we're literally we're literally so close to it so it says we can start walking this way perfect smoothie slash slushy I've ever had in my life. It's the mango, the frozen mango one. Oh my gosh, it is insane, 100 out of 10. I got chicken quesadilla and we, we got spaghetti meatball. We like some parmesan cheese, sir. We're here. We just got our snow gear. We're about to head in. I'm happy, I'm tired though. Oh, I wish I could have a nap. <laughs> but we don't have time. We have a reservation at 9.30 for dinner. And one thing about this hotel, do you know what? It has some of its downfalls. But the positive thing is the room service, the service in general is so good. So we just came home and low key, we left the room a little bit of a mess. But they've done it up so nice. Look, they even pair shoes all together, lined up. They even folded up my charges. Like that was so cute. Our clothes that we're just hanging around on the bed so shout out to the room service team here and to be honest like the service in general has been really 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 nice so yeah we're gonna get ready for i think our second to last night um the second to last dinner i mean it with my friend khadija you um, probably have seen her in the vlogs before and yeah we're going to a restaurant called the nice guy she said it was really good and yeah i am tired i need an espresso effective immediately and then I need to get ready. All I have is on on is concealer, which I actually look kind of. I think the sun does something to like my skin, to chocolate skin especially. Like all I have is concealer, and I feel so nice and glowy and dewy. But yeah, let's get ready. Mm. I haven't even been able to comb my hair once this trip, just because of how hectic this has been. Oh, but yeah, we move. It's all about having a good time. It's not always about looking perfect. You know what I mean? 
let's get ready to rumble. Ah! Oh. I live with a monster. Why did you push me on the bed? Why did I push you on the bed? You just pushed me. Yes. See, now they're seeing the, your true colors. My true colors. <laughs> he just Crazy. literally, oh, was minding my business vlogging and I he wish, pushed me onto the bed. I wish people really knew. What? Get out of here. They know me. They've been they've been riding with me for nope. like nearly ten years. So per. Don't worry, guys. One, <laughs> one of these days you're gonna get a vow special where I give you like the inside scoop. Absolutely not. I think Immediately so. Immediately no. Goodbye, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna ban you from my channel to be honest. Do you know what's mad? There'll be there'll be riots in the comment section. Riots. Yeah, there'll be riots. Anywho, anywho. There'll be riots. I'm like, where's Vow? Right. Where is Val? Let me get ready, girl. Hmm. Today we are at the Atlantis water park and we are gonna go on loads of slides. I'm really scared because this is literally so out of my comfort zone, but I'm kind of excited. Um and yeah let's just see how it goes like i'm really cheap and i've and i had to change my wig because i didn't want to ruin my nice blonde wig so yeah i have put on this curly hair so that if it gets wet then it's fine um so yeah i'm so shook right now Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Comment the palm tree emoji so I know that you watched it this far and you are the real MVP. Love you so much. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more travel content. We're off to the airport. I'm not happy, I'm sad. But God is good. What they dream of, what you want to do. You will be good. Thank you.